Hey, this is Lewis from SoFly, and in this video, I want to show you how to use HTML5 semantic elements with Oxygen. Semantic means that the HTML tag itself describes something about what the element is, uh, both to the developer and the browser, any search engine robots reading the content, etc. So by default in Oxygen, if you add a section, it just uses the section HTML tag. But on the left side, you have this tag drop down, and this allows you to choose any other HTML5 tag that would make sense for a section. For example, header, footer, article, main, or just a plain div. Um, for the div element, you can go down to the tag drop down, you can choose div, but then you also have the other HTML5 tags that would make sense to use for a div, like article, aside, details, footer, header, h group, mark, nav, etc. Um, for a rich text element or a text element, you have HTML5 tags that would make sense for uh, that element. And if you add in really any other container type element, an element where you could put something in or will output content, for example, a code block or a short, short code, short code wrapper, and then you can choose the tag, div, paragraph, heading tags, section footer, fake caption time summary, etc. So everything you need here, uh, everything you would need in terms of HTML5 tag choices is here in the tag dropdown. This is available for the elements where it would make sense that you would want to um, actually change the tag. For something like an image element, of course, you can't change the tag to display an image in HTML. You need to use the IMG tag. A link would be the same. It's an A tag always. But for those elements where you might want to change the tag, that choice is available in the tag dropdown in the left panel. Okay, again, this is Lewis from SoFly, and thank you very much for watching.